Hi lovelies! I'm here again for another card reading and I just wanted to say um, a few things before we get started. Um, one, I'm kind of going inwards right now into a healing phase so I won't be as like active on social media for a while but I think you'll live <laughs> without my posts regularly filling up your feed um, and I'll share more about that when I'm on the other side. Oops. Also, I wanted to share that to, as of today, Monday, um, December 5th, there's one more week left of my special holiday offer. If you buy one gift certificate for a service, you will get a 50% off voucher for your next service. So it's like buy one, get one 50% off for you. And that can include... Um, Akashic Records readings, chakra readings, energy healings, all that fun stuff that is always so um, activating and healing and uh, clarifying and uplifting. Um, it's like the favorite part of my work that I do is offering these services. So that offer of buy one, get one 50% off will expire on December 12th. Okay. So Today, for the card reading, I'm using one of my favorite decks, Gateway of Light Activation by Kyle Gray. And this is it. So think of a question about your life, like maybe go inwards. Think, oh, what question do you have about your life right now? It could just be as simple as what guidance do I need this week? Or, you know, something specific. And now feel into your intuition, into your gut. Is it telling you that card one is going to be your message or card two? So feel that right now um, with your question in mind, which card, card one or card two, is going to be your answer. Okay, so let me just get to card one. I'm just shuffling. I'm not the best shuffler. Okay, there's one card that popped up. Card one. Oh, beautiful. Angelic frequency, angels are here, you are safe. Potent connection. Mmm, that's so beautiful. Okay, let me just kind of feel into the energy of this card before I speak to it. So your guides want you to know that you're very, very, very much supported in whatever you're asking about, whatever your question was. Um, I'm feeling some like uplifting energy, like I'm feeling kind of like I'm being lifted up, um, like I'm being supported and held, you know, like as a mother might hold their baby or or just like your guides are, are uplifting you at, at this time in this way regarding your question. And because there's a lot of like linear aspects with repeating patterns, I'm just being reminded that Within you is there's an encoded um, potentiality and po encoded power and encoded um, like mastery that you can unlock that you can ask for help in activating or in um, awakening to these these codes within you. So you can ask your angels or your guides. I'm getting. I mean, this is an angelic card. So if you're like uh, who are my angels? This is weird. Just like accept that there are things in your life, in the universe that are unexplainable. Um, as we know about like quantum physics, it's like really blows our minds every time we, there's a new discovery. So you are safe. You are being supported by your angels, by high frequency guides. These are very high frequency beings meaning um, they are meant to uplift you and like raise your, your vibration, your frequency. So you can ask for help and support by like 
kind of going inwards and connecting with your the center of your being like in a meditation or just in, in your sitting and ask for guidance ask for support because they want to support you but they need to be asked it's a consent thing it's a free will thing they need they need permission to come and support you so that is the wisdom from card one now card two if you have picked card two related to the question you've asked about your life let's see which card is emerging oh i keep getting two okay two cards for card for card two Oh, interesting. Okay. The first card is Star Being Healing Codes. Important information. Wounds are healed. Recharging. It's a very powerful image. I think this one's for me. <laughs> because I have recently received important information that will help me heal some wounds that I uh, that have emerged over the last few months which is always the how it happens there's you're never finished healing it's a lifelong process um okay star being healing codes hang on Okay, so I'm getting reminded that there's like a timeline of this healing that's coming up for you. Like maybe memories are re-emerging or you're being triggered in certain ways that are reminding you that there are things that you need to work on that would help, help you be like the highest version of you. If you can like work on these things or like overcome these things or like heal these wounds. And maybe you've already healed them at this time but it seems like they're kind of happening right now. Like you're, you're in the process of being reminded of what needs to be healed. And there's like a timeline of it. Like this is this phase. And then the next phase is like the deep healing. And then the next phase is like recharging after you've been um, gone through the healing process. And you are being supported again. You're being so supported by um, star beings star beings they're just like our guides they're just the the people who um are on the other side that we cannot like see who are there to support us so just know that you are going to be receiving important information or maybe you already have related to what your question is and you're going to be going through a healing process and it's all meant to happen now now is the time it's meant to happen. It wasn't meant to happen six months ago. It's not meant to happen in the spring. It's meant to happen now for you. And if you can accept that, that will make the process much smoother. Okay, the next card for card two, remember I pulled two on, um, well, two kind of kept coming up and I kept shoving them down and kept shuffling and then they kept coming up again. So, um, mm, interesting. Stargate heart, heart chakra opening, unlocking, generosity. That's beautiful. And there's a Merkaba symbol there. There's like a gate going to some like magical looking kingdom, right? So this is the gate of your heart, your heart chakra, which is all about love and loving others and loving yourself. So for you, there's going to be, I think this goes really well with the first card that was for card two, the healing codes. And this is all about heart chakra opening. So perhaps there's going to be healing related to your heart chakra, maybe related to past wounding that has wounded your heart or um, maybe from past lives that has impacted your ability to have an open heart chakra and there's going to be an unlocking this is kind of exciting <laughs> there's 
going to be an unlocking and this will include, um, well, it says the word generosity, like you're going to feel the outpouring of love for others. So that will make you naturally want to be generous. And it is the holiday season in um, many parts of the world where there is more generosity happening and there is more giving and, and sharing of love right now. So that could be happening for you. Um, there's a lot of green, which is heart chakra. Let me just see if there's anything more I can pick up from this. I'm getting the word allow, 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 allowing it to happen and not fighting it because sometimes it doesn't feel safe because of what we've experienced, our wounding or our past life conditioning or whatever. It might not feel safe to open your heart because you want to protect yourself and that's completely natural. That's like a natural instinct, but just know this is happening for a reason and if you're resisting it, it's going to cause more turbulence turbulence is the word that came to me. Um, if you can trust that this is happening for a reason, maybe you're going through a difficult time and you're like, Ooh, I don't like this, but it, it could be happening for a reason to help you heal certain things and open your heart. Um, this is happening for a reason. Trust, um, allow, 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 allow it to happen even if it doesn't feel good. That's what I'm going through right now. Um, some things are coming up that I need to have trust in and I will share more about that. Um, okay, so finally, I just wanted to share again. This is my little flimsy printed gift certificate. What you'll really receive if you get a gift certificate certificate from me is a digital one you're not going to get a flimsy paper one but i wanted to show you gift certificate if you buy one of these you'll get a 50 percent off voucher for your next um service from me and that will um that offer expires on december 12th i have a little bit of availability in december i think there's like one day left that i um actually blocked off my calendar so I can allow time and space for my healing. But there's one one or two days on there still that I have availability and January is open now so you can book. You'll also receive this with your gift certificate and you'll get a 50% off voucher, which is pretty cool. Okay, everybody, if you watched this long, if you watched all 12 minutes worth, um, thank you. Thank you for watching and I hope this, I really, really do, I really, really, really do hope this is helpful and supportive to you for your life and your journey at this time right now.